<laughs> okay, welcome to the show. This is H Grimace we've got on today. Hello. H Grimace, would like to introduce yourselves? Hannah. Asha. Alright, we'll get going. So who came up with the name Hannah? Oh, my name Hannah. Yeah. My parents. Why are you laughing? Do you like animals? Yes. Not all of them. Most of them. I'm not first, actually. You're not first. I really like animals, except for spiders. You don't like spiders? No. But you have been known to eat them. No, that's animals. a rumour. Vicious rumour. What spiders? Vicious rumour. No more spiders. That's done. There's one time. I like spiders. We're going to talk about your band for a bit now. <laughs> Are you? What's, what's your least favourite H. Grimace song? Oh, psh, come on. Do you think we we play something we didn't like? I yes. Um, What's yours? I think it's this song where there's just bass and drums and I have to sing over it. I feel like a wally. Oh uh, yeah. That one. Okay. What do we call it? Um. I don't even know if it's got a name. The punky one. We call it punky one. It's not punky got a one. name. We've got some new songs though. Yeah. They're a bit happier. A bit happier. Oh, and yeah. you're liking all of them. Yeah, yeah. There's one pop song. It's, it's not really not pop. It's kind of pop. It's jolly. Fans don't like saying pop, do they? No, it's I think pop's fine. a good thing. Pop's a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> pop's fine, Joe. Sure. Pop's fine. Pop's we'll move on to the next question now. If you if you could live underwater, what would you take with you and why? I'd take Kevin Cosner because he's got webbed feet. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. <laughs> that was nice. <laughs> I'd take probably the lobster from Little Mermaid. Really? Yeah, he was probably the funnest underwater. Sebastian. Yeah. You wouldn't need Sebastian. to take him though, there'd probably be one down there. Yeah, but like a talking one. Okay. So he'd come in handy to help you out with any sort of problems you might yeah, have. Songwriting. He was like an yeah, songwriting? He was like the lead songwriter. Yeah, yeah. In that <laughs> film. Pretty sure he wrote the soundtrack to Little Mermaid. Okay, so you're going to be so, hanging out with Sebastian. He's yeah. also very fucking cool. Yeah, he's really cool. Yeah. Very cool guy. So now I've got a vision he's of you nice swimming guy. on the back of a teeny lobster <laughs> and you swimming on the back of a Oh no, he's right now. <laughs> Look, I never said about getting on his back, Joe. Joe jumped to conclusions. Okay, alright. Uh, how, how do you like your eggs? Pretty much any way possible. Yeah, runny. No! Runny. Well, I like them running. <laughs> That's the only way I wouldn't eat. I don't like them running. Really. Uh -oh. But do you know what, if you had them with chilli? Yeah. Chilli chili and cheese, a bit of parmesan. Yeah. Mm. yeah. <laughs> well, that's, that's another I started form eating of cheese, isn't it? What, parmesan? <laughs> yeah. Or egg? Oh, what are we talking about? No, I'd have my egg soft boiled with Oh, did I say egg? I meant cheese. Oh. You said, oh, you you said, said egg. You said yeah, egg. cheese, sorry. How did I, I have that cheese? On, how do you like your cheese? <laughs> cheese yeah. Great, it? Okay. <laughs> I'll have it on anything. Melted. And now the next question, how do you like your eggs? <laughs> with, with, my cheese. Cheese. Yeah. with your cheese. And Parmesan. Okay. And Kevin Costa. Oh. Alright, next question now. Do you think statues should be banned and explained? Yeah. I think they should be banned. Because what? it'd be much better now to have something that you could interact with standing up in the street like a person. Mm -hmm. I, I like statues. I get more interactive. More interactive. Okay. And then if they're dead, then stuffed. Just stuff them. Yeah, and then put them on display. Yeah, and then change <laughs> the pose every now and again. Yeah, I'm not sure about this question. So, but it's you think they, they should just be banned? They no, just get some holograms, more. get some fucking... Up to date. Keep it up to date. Technology okay, involved. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, what do you like about music? Um... There's something for every single session Child. of the day. You know, there's, there's, it can be like a soundtrack to your life. Well, it is like a soundtrack to your life. That's yeah. why I see music in every scenario. Be it washing. Soundtrack, you got a soundtrack on. Yeah, yeah. family have a soundtrack on. Yeah. It fills a void. In the early 1970s, the Colonel experimented with using cornflakes to coat his delicious dead bits of chicken instead of bread. The public, however, didn't buy into the idea, and KFC rebranded itself with the secret ingredient of breadcrumbs we know and love today. 
If you were given the opportunity, despite public backlash, which two animals would you marry together? <laughs> I think two animals that would be awesome together would be like the body of a slug, but like the head of a like cheetah. Yeah. Because it'd be like so used to going fast, but have this ridiculously <laughs> slow so body. It'd be so annoying. Oh, so annoyed with or give a slug, no, a slug's head on a cheetah's body. Yeah. So the slug would just be like. And then it's probably be going for it, and then you just <laughs> wouldn't have a clue what's going on. Oh, yeah, that'd be great. Some sort of like fusion you that just. just ch you're going mess messing with their minds there. Yeah, it'd just be funny. Because there's not many animals that you look at that are really funny. Slug lettuce? No, slug. Slug cheetah. Slug cheetah. Well, I went straight to like, what would you like to eat? Which is terrible. As I'm not really that into animals, I can't answer that question. H. Grimace, slug and a cheetah, morose, fill the void. Confidently. Can you give us your favourite Michael Jackson dance move? Well, I've, I've practised one that a friend taught me, but not very well. Did you get that? <laughs> Did you get that? I told you I couldn't do it. She didn't get that. I think you go many of No, I can't quite do it. Yeah? Um, probably be just that one. Oh, that was good. Oh, yeah. Thanks for your time, H. Oh, thank, thank you. you. I've learned a lot. Uh, and we'll, we'll be back next next week from Crumb Cabin uh, TV. Thanks. Thanks. Bye.